there are several ways to add labels to objects within Sybil 3D. Sometimes labels are added to objects automatically as soon as they are created, based on how the command settings are set up. On the ribbon, Home tab, Create Design Panel, Expand Alignment, and select the Alignment Creation Tools. In the Create Alignment Layout dialog box, accept the defaults, except at the bottom, where you can see the Alignment Label Set option. A label set is just a collection of label styles. You can add this label set to the object so that it is automatically labeled when it is created. Choose a label set and then click OK. Next, sketch in an alignment. When you are finished, zoom in and you can see that station labels were automatically added. This is because in the label set that you selected are multiple labels that are already configured to be used when creating an alignment. You can also add additional labels to this alignment. For instance, perhaps you want to add a station offset label. On the ribbon, annotate tab, labels and tables panel, expand add labels, and select alignment station offset fixed. Now in the drawing, select the alignment, and then select a location to place the station offset label. This now labels the station offset according to the label style that was set as the default. You can click and drag the station offset label to move it around to a new location, and you can see that all the values update. You can also use the AutoCAD copy command to copy this label and place it somewhere else, and again, the values automatically update. To label a spot elevation of a surface, first select the surface to open the context sensitive ribbon. Then in the Labels and Tables tab, select Add Labels, Spot Elevations. You're prompted to select a point. Select a location in the drawing and the spot elevation label appears. Similarly to the station offset label, you can select this label and move it around. As you do, you can see that the elevation is updating in real time. You can also copy it. And when you specify the second point, you can immediately see the new elevation there. You can also find the labels commands on the annotate tab of the ribbon, just like you did with the alignments. Click the annotate tab, labels and tables panel, and select add labels to open the add labels dialog box. From the drop-down menus, you can select the feature and the label type. For example, expand feature and select surface. And then expand label type and select spot elevation. The bottom options change to allow you to select the label style. Accept the default and then click add. Now in the drawing, select the surface and then select a location for your label. Again, you can add multiple labels this way as well. This method creates the same type of label, even using the same style as when you use the command in the context sensitive ribbon, or one of the other labeling commands. Or you can change the style before adding your label. Civil 3D gives you several ways to add labels to objects with ease.